This is for your 11 methods that comes out of 11a, question number 8. The table shows a prob probability distribution for the random variable x. The probability that it is bigger than 3 is the same as the probability that x is bigger than or equal to 4. So it's going to be 4, 5 and 6. So it's going to equal 0.27 plus 0 0.20 plus 0 0.13, 0 carry 1, 6. 0 0.6 will be the answer. Probability that x is bigger than 3 but less than 6 is the same as the probability that x is less than or equal to 4 and less than or equal to 5 because I don't include 3 and I don't include 6. So it's going to be these two only which is going to be 0 0.47. And the probability that x is bigger than 4, given that it's bigger than 2. I can use the a given b rule, which is the probability of a intersect b over the probability of b. So that would be the probability that x is bigger than or equal to 4 intersect x is bigger than or equal to 2 over the probability that x is bigger than or equal to 2. Okay, so if I consider bigger than or equal to 4 is 4, 5 and 6. Bigger than or equal to 2 is 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Where is the intersection? 4, 5 and 6. So it's equal to the probability that x is bigger than or equal to 4 over the probability that x is bigger than or equal to 2. The bigger than or equal to 4 are those, which is 0 0.6. And bigger than or equal to 2 is all of this, which is everything except that, so 0 0.9. So it's going to be 6 on 9 which is 3, sorry, 2 on 3. So it's going to equal 2 thirds.